President Biden is coming to town. Find out what brings him to San Diego. And election day is just a few days away. We'll tell you where you can learn more about propositions and candidates. And with today's wet weather, we welcome snow to our local mountains. New Scene Today starts now. I'm Jillian Fortner and welcome to New Scene Today. We start with local candidates calling on big names to help boost their campaigns right before Election Day. And there is no bigger name than President Biden. Biden will be in San Diego this week showing his support for Congressperson Mike Levin. According to an email sent from Maricosa students today, Biden will speak on the Oceanside campus tomorrow evening. Multiple reports have also have him speaking at an unspecified event on Friday. And you don't have to wait until Tuesday to make your voice heard. The statewide general election is on November 8th, and the San Diego Community College District would like to remind students, faculty, classified professionals, and administrators to register and vote. If you have not yet registered, same-day registration and provisional voting is available through Election Day. To learn more about the propositions and candidates on the ballot, visit sdvote.org. And keep your tissue box handy because COVID and influenza are on the rise. And San Diego now has a new way to track these respiratory illnesses. The county's Health and Human Service Agency has rolled out a new respiratory virus surveillance report. This report monitors COVID and flu activity in the county. The agency plans to release new reports every Thursday. And the data on that report is telling us that the flu season is expected to be more severe this year. There are some simple ways to keep yourself healthy, especially through the holidays. You've heard them before. Avoid close contact with others, cover your nose and mouth with a mask, and wash your hands often. And as always, stay home if you're not feeling well. And with today's wet weather comes a sign of winter. Snow is starting to fall in our local mountains. A winter weather advisory has been issued for some parts of San Diego until 10 tonight. Snow levels are, levels are expected to be about 5,500 feet today and drop even lower between by Thursday morning. A drive to Mount Laguna might be in my future. And city sports fans, winter sports are also heating up. Our men's basketball team will open its new season tomorrow. Over 15 days, the Knights will play five games. Unfortunately, all these games are on the road, but the team will be back in Harry West Gym at the end of the month. And while you wait for the men's basketball team to return home, you can check out City Theater's second fall production. Imogen Says Nothing is entering its last weekend of shows. The comedic play follows the story of Imogen, who is part bear, part woman. If you're interested in tickets, visit citycollegetheater.com. And finally, today is the last day of Dia de los Muertos. The Old Town San Diego is hosting its annual event to reunite the living and the dead. Altars honoring those who have passed can be found throughout the State Historic Park. The celebration continues at dusk with the traditional candlelight procession. Organizers are encouraging visitors to use public transporta transportation today to avoid issues with traffic and parking. And that's all we have for New Scene today. Look more from the CTTV team on YouTube. And you can also keep up with the latest news from the entire City Times media team on sccitytimes.com. This is Jillian Fortner. See you next time.